Alright, welcome back to Bentley Boys Rips. We are once again at the Downtown Hunt with Optic 2022 Football. We have three blasters from Walmart, the last three on the shelf, so maybe, just maybe, that's the right set kind of vibe luck we need. Um, but yeah, you know the drill. Uh, best stuff we pulled is like a teal velocity, we pulled one sticker auto, we've got a fire emoji, just recently got a blue glitter rated rookie, which was nice. Uh, but man, we have still not even hit a base uh, Kenny Pickett rated rookie with 24 boxes open. So I think that tells you a lot. One. Oh, Knox. Knox to my side is telling me maybe one. Uh, well, that, not a base though. Yeah, he said a My House, which is true. We hit a, a Kenny Pickett My House, but we have not hit the rated rookie version of Kenny Pickett. So Walmart, as you know, has the Purple Shock uh, parallel, which is nice. Ty Chandler, got the Viking Raider rookie. Oh. <laughs> what are the odds of that? The very first pack, if you complain, you'll get it. No, I'm kidding, kids. Don't, don't complain. But um, that's exciting, man. That's awesome. We finally got... I'm going to even hard top you, buddy, just because enough times I talk about it, it's finally nice to see it. He does exist. We're off to a good start. <laughs> um, all right. This feels like a mem. Something in there, yeah. It looks it feels a little smaller, which is it's probably just, you know, I can't keep track of which ones are which. Rashad White, base rated rookie. And then we got a hollow of Pierre Strong Jr. Oh, that's a nice one. Take that. A good one to get. It's hard to get some of those hollows that are rated rookies um, and even get like a decent player. So it's fun to kind of see someone you want to see there. All right, and then our mem card. Let's see here. We have is that Velas Jones? I don't know what. Yep, it's gonna be. I don't remember what RP is. Rookie Phenom. So that's one of those blue hyper. So that's a good one. That's fun. Get off to the side. And then Mario Davis on the base. Yeah. yeah. Knox, Knox was checking to see if it was a uh, player worn. And um, deep down, we know the answer to that. Especially with the rookies. It's much impossible to get player worn on those or so it seems to me oh nice it's a good purple shock rated rookie with a Trayvon Walker off to a <clears throat> pretty decent start here honestly just hitting the, the base Kenny Pickett was a revelation Pierce on the rookies, Josh Pasco on the purple shock, and got a sauce there. Nice. Take those. Let's see from just like an overall solid standpoint. Nothing so far, you know, mind blowing. Uh, from an overall standpoint, this has been a, a good box for sure. Got a Joe Montana on the hollow, and a Cam Taylor Britt. funny you know someone that just gets back into card collecting would see this card and think oh my god that's a huge hit and it's a cool card and it's nice to have the hollow but they're they're not people aren't looking for the retired vets looks like one of those retro series back there let's see and i was right champ bay that he was a stud and then we get a breeze hall on the base nice those are good cards i would say that was just a solid box right Knox it wasn't anything again that was like oh my god we hit a downtown we hit a blazers um we got an auto but very solid box a workman's box we're looking for the mind-blowing box though
All right, box number two. Like I said, these were the final three boxes that were there. Couldn't leave a single straggler, so I did. We did grab them all. And maybe we'll get some last box sort of mojo going here at some point. I don't know which one was the final one sitting there, but nice. Justin Jefferson, my house. Nux, that one can be yours if you want it. Shaking your head no? Seriously? All right, well. Let me top load it. I think he's one of those players we're going to look back and say he's a top three wide receiver of all time. First three years certainly would suggest that, but <clears throat> time will tell. Duffy on the hollow, rated rookie, nice. Rising Suns with a Peyton Manning. I think we got his brother the last time, Eli, if I recall, with that card. And then Montreal, Washington on the purple shock and a base. Matt Corral, it is a QB, so can't complain. Not sure, well, I think we all know where his career is probably going unless something happens, considering what they got Bryce Young in the first pick. All right, nothing wild there. So you can tell the difference between those two boxes. First one, just solid box. This one, eh, very meh. Can change quickly, but still very meh. J.K. Dobbins on the hollow and Wandell Robinson on the base. Carson Strong, not even in. Hey, Brock, did we get one of these bases already? Yeah, nice. All right. Love to see a hollow or a purple shock at him, but man, that's awesome. So we got a Kenny Pickett, we got a Brock Purdy. Pretty decent QBs on these boxes. Still looking for that mind blowing box. Someone once said, third time's a charm. Max, spread some luck to this box. You rub it on your head. Oh, there we go. That was the that was the trick. We just a little little hair rub on top of Knox, and now we got the box that we all were looking for. So, truth be told, what we went to like four or five stores trying to find some optic. The final store was a Walmart that kind of has to hide their cards, and so this was the only ones. So if we don't get anything here, we'll kind of. SOL for a while, short of it coming back, which hopefully does retro series. And then David Ajabo on the base. Oh, bump the camera. Brian Cook on the hollow. We got his auto on one of our boxes and George Pickens, nice. Come on. Looks like I'll light it up, I think. Dude, I think we have at least one of these, maybe two. Well, I don't know. Maybe this is the only stuff on decks. I can't keep track sometimes. And the Logan Hall on the Purple Shock. Present Trey McBride. Carl Patterson on the hollow, Khalil Shakir. Last pack mojo. Come on. Purple 
shocked on this one. Oh, man, that's that's two openings in a row that we're gonna get a blue glitter on the final pack of all of our boxes. All right, fingers crossed that we get something amazing here. Charles Cross, got a purple shock of, I swear to God, this is the same pack. All right, first of all, it is a rated rookie, I think, because I think these are all rated rookies. Yep. Oh, Christian, come on, Christian. Come on, Christian. Yeah! <laughs> That's a good one. Let's get weird, buddy. Let's get weird. All right, two blue glitters in openings in a row. And that's a solid wide receiver, unlike our last one to get. Can't complain about that, right? Very nice. What do you think, Knox? Yep, you got the head nod, so approval. Approval gained. All right, I'm gonna load these up and then we will run through all of our hits. So just hang tight. All right, let's run through the uh, the best hits from these three boxes. This, these were actually definitely the most solid boxes we've had in a little bit. Um, just again, overall, uh, no downtown. Let's just jump right to it. No Blazers, but we did hit a super short print. We did hit a mem. We did hit some of the QBs finally. Um, so I'm excited. So that, you know, final three boxes uh, at a Walmart. You see three boxes, two boxes, one box. Grab that final one and uh, give it a shot. So these are some of the quick ones. Rashad White on uh, the base, Matt Corral. Got some Retro Series, Rising Sun, and then some Hollows with some Vets, Joe Montana, Trent McDuffie, J.K. Dobbins. You can see them all there. Some Purple Shock that, you know, just some of the Purple Shock that you'll get in these boxes. Nothing totally mind-blowing on those. And then our best hits, we've kind of top loaded, the ones I at least consider. So we get to get the hype, Blue Hyper, Fellas Jones Jr. Um, you know, not I'm not always excited with the Mims, especially considering none of them are really player worn for the most part. Um, and then this is a George Pickens, Brees Hall, got a Sauce. Those are all base. Did get a Hollow of Pierre Strong Jr., which is a nice looking card. Got a Trayvon Walker, Purple Shock. Got a Lighted Up Stefan Diggs. Got the JJ My House. This one's going to Knox unless he refuses it. We did finally hit a Kenny Pickett base. I'll take it. I've complained enough times that a base is just fine with me. Not a hollow, not a parallel, but still beautiful. We did hit another Brock Purdy. We've hit two of these base of his. So again, I'll take it. And then the best hit by far was a blue glitter, super short print. Christian Watson looks pretty beautiful. So um, excited about this one for sure. Um, anyway, you guys, tell us what you think below. We are just going to continue to blow through everything we have on Optic. Um, it, again, I think for the price, for retail, it, it's the one to buy right now. I, it's better than Prism as far as what you get for retail. It's, it's, um, it's better than spending five, 600 bucks or more on the hobby box and really kind of shooting for the stars. Not to say that we haven't spent plenty of money on these retail boxes, but give it a shot. Take a look. See what you think. Um, tell us what you think below. Hit that like, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have fun out there, and we'll see you next time.